And hey there guys, what's going on? And welcome back to the Ultimate RTG. And trust me, to be the one having team problems just before the Ultimate Team of the Season Weekend League. Yep, that's me. And why is that? Well, we went through some changes and it hasn't instantly clicked like it did with Sancho leading the line alongside Atel. Now, it's not to say Mbappe is a bad player, Atel's bad, Nani's bad, none of that. It just hasn't felt as good as it did last week. And that could be a number of reasons. Myself, the game, the players. And I don't believe it's Mbappe because everybody else is loving him. So, And he's 5 mil and he has 99 stats in all areas. So we're going to keep positive and we're going to make this work. And if you're enjoying this series, thumbs up on today's video. Subscribe if you're new and click the bell if you're enjoying the content. And Sancho was sold last week anyway. Fonte, Klaus came from the Foot Champ Rewards. But who's the missing third player that we packed? You know, Marquinhos. And would I dare disrespect him? No. We don't sell Marquinhos. We get him into the starting 11. Now, it's a little bit risky because I haven't used him, nor have I even tried out Navas. But one thing that blew me away last night, the price of this card. And keep in mind, he is a centre-back. So many people on this game that are regulars prefer to use, well, centre-backs in centre-back positions. And I'm not judging, and neither should you. But the price, he was 250000 Now, all right, it's gone up a little bit now. And I just thought, wow, for what you get, really, medium high work rate, very good physical stats now, which is really the problem that Marquinhos had on recent FIFAs and just really even with this regular card, he needs more strength and aggression. Added with that, you've got the defending, you've got the composure, reactions. It's just a marvelous, marvelous card. And one thing that is outrageous, right? Look at his finishing 40. How many goals does he get IRL? Every single time I'm watching PSG, he's getting a, getting a finish. So to give him only 40, nah, he should be 65. Should be 60 to 65 in my personal opinion. But Makinos is in. Navas, the GOAT of the RTG. He's, a, he's in. And just the stats with Mbappe haven't really been anything special. 13 games, 10 goals, 3 assists. I mean, yeah, is what it is. Nani, though, 6 games, 5 goals, 4 assists. He feels great. Next weekend, we're going to have him leading the line alongside somebody. Or Atel will be sold. So we've got like an Atel replacement. And it's going to be a really, really fun card. So do you like the look of the team? I, I think I do. I just hope that it plays well in game. So we've got Mbabu coming on. And we've got Lazaro. We're having to make some instant subs. Okay. And I am a little bit scared to jump into foot champs right now. So I want to test out this creation. In Rivals, I played so many games last night. I think I played like 11. I know, I, I was just trying to figure out what's going to be the best setup. But will Marquinhos come in and secure the defense? Will Mbappe really snap out of this weird form? Or I need to get better with him. So we have a real potent attack. Let's go and try it. Sticking with Mbappe is the right move. I, I, I hope that it was just down to the way I was playing yesterday. And that's a fantastic team. Go on, Mbappe. He's feeling nice right now. But will we get the goals, though? It's one thing feeling nice. And there's another thing getting the goals as my striker. And that's one thing that I was probably lacking, actually, getting getting goals. Now, what can Lionel Messi do from here? Joshua Kimmich. Oh. Every game feels really tough recently. Oh, nine. No, he's got me as well. Ooh, what a terrible shot from Lataro. That was absolutely horrendous. He's found that through ball to R9. That is not good. It's just R9 effect, isn't it? Well done, Mbabu. It's the R9 show. It's causing us some great difficulties. Oh, oi, 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 oi. Give him, put him in the book. Oi, ref. Put him in that book. Didn't even get a card, did he? Oh, he did, he did. He's using uh, David Alaba. Mine. Yes, Rosilion. Good tackle. Not bad. Not bad, not great. I don't know where to go with it. He's an insane defender. I didn't really check his team. I wasn't paying too much attention to it. Biera. Oh, no. Come on, Mbappe. I was going to call him R9. The French R9. Good strength, though. I can't find a way through. These guys, I think, have just got better. He's done well, though. Yes, this is much better. Opened up. Come on, it's a tough game as well. Good. Flick it. At all. Bang. I think, honestly, that's our first real shot.
Okay, we've had two. It's been a very close game, though. Tough, tough opponent. Good pass over from him. I think he wants to get his R9. I'm waiting. Oh, that's nice. It was nice. Dear, oh dear. I think he's got me. No, well played. Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. I've choked. He's coming this way, though. Good read. I can't get him. He's wriggling his way through. Is he on size? Damn, he did find it. I made such a bad mistake, though, before. I wonder what his skill rating is going to be because he seems like a fantastic player with what he's what, what, what he's doing. Little back one. No, no, no. I've passed that straight back to um, Coutinho. This is where I'm having problems in, in my attack. He's just going to keep tracking. He has. You should have played a switch, really. Oh, lovely football. Oh, lovely football. And once again, it's Atel. He should have played a switch, though. Uh, he's got me here. Oh, he's just wriggled through. Marquinhos, I can't play a switch. I've got, oh, I think I've just bought myself some time there. Now he's got me. Jesus, his Lacroquette cancels are nuts. But I think that just bought me enough time. 89th minute. He's got a chance. That's gone through me. No way. Good block, though. That went through my uh, defender, whoever that was on the left-hand side. That's not right. Get out. Just clear it. GG. Wow, what a warm-up game. That was tough. But another match where Mbappe really hasn't done anything for me. He just hasn't. Who, who was the clutch player in the attack? It was Atel scoring the goals. Let's do it. Here we go again. Georgie boy, he's got Nanny. Congrats, Red Nanny. Uh, Bamba in there. That's a cool team. Got to hold this line. I've got to hold this position. Well done, Marquinhos. That is so rushed, it's not funny. Oh, I took him out. Hey, that was a foul, yeah. What the hell? It's not even a foul for him. Resilient. If he's going to let you run, you run. Support someone. Good run. Oh, phenomenal run. Mbappe has moved away from the play, but it opened up the space for the middle. So it's a good position, actually. He helped the team with his movement there. Should have probably done better with the finish. Mbappe's here, though. Drag back, maybe. Left foot. Mbappe, go, 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 go. Don't be scared to run. You have the power. You got the pace. Left foot. We've made it to half time. No goals. Thanks to Mbappe. I'm, I'm, I'm glad you've seen it, though. I'm glad you've seen that sort of shot with him. Which is bizarre. I, I don't know. He just has that tendency right now just to miss some silly, silly opportunities. Frankie de Jong. That's good. I like that a lot. I like that a lot. He needs no introduction. It's him again. Mbappe. Oh, this is scum. EA are doing it on purpose. It's not Mbappe. It's EA at this point. I'm losing my mind. I'm going crazy playing this game. That was a through ball pass. Finally, I was in a good position with Mbappe as he was making a run. So credit to him. And the and the uh, pass went up the field. Oh, dear. <laughs> the pass went up the field instead of through where I aimed it. That's mental. It, it, oh, man. I, I feel like Mbappe would have done something. No. No, 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 no. That's what a pass that was. Fair play. That was a good ball into the box. 70th minute. Uh oh. I'm going to make a sub. It's time to bring on Nanny. That's a foul. Oh, what a silly challenge there. Very clumsy. All right, it's just one of those games. I'll try and save this. It doesn't really mean much, but I'll try and save it anyway. I'll bring on Nanny for the last 10 minutes, see if he can come on and clutch up, because I guess we're going to have to be chasing the game, or are we going to save this? Oh, right, Nanny steps up for him. Which side? I think he's going to go in the middle. Navas. 
That's a good ball. What a save. Navas, you hero. He's a decent goalkeeper, he is. Go on, Danny, lay that off. Ooh. Oh, he got up quick. Was that um, a cancel? Go on, Lazaro. Nanny wants it. Lazaro. Nanny, cut, pass it. De Jong, bang. Already. It was obvious where he was going. Marquinhos shuts the door. And we've got another W, boys. Woo. Let's go. 2-1. That's nice. Nice. And we clutched up, though. Navas. He was really one of the better goalkeepers to save pens for whatever reason. He was unbelievable with it. We just got to get through this weekend league. Whatever we've got to change, we change. We get the W's. We get that elite rank. And then going forward, we'll have Mbappe being played alongside Nani for next week. And then we'll really see if he's, uh, see what he's about. But for the ultimate team of the season, I don't know if I can risk it. I don't. And I, I can't believe I'm actually saying that. Mbappe team of the season and I'm not getting on with him like what is going on I don't get it I don't get it but I think it's going to be best for the team honestly it's crazy I feel insane I actually feel mental what's going on with him what's wrong with him like seriously what was that shot did you see the shot you know, I'm not making this up did you see that shot insane boys thank you very much for watching I'll be seeing you guys in tomorrow's video. Um, we're going to soon see how we're getting on in the weekend league. I might have to change this up a little bit. Marquinhos, by the way, feels nice. Uh, in, in some uh, defensive like plays, I thought he was going to feel a little bit stronger. I'm not going to lie. But he's still a pretty complete centre-back to use. I do like him. Navas was uh, fantastic. Yeah, he conceded a couple of goals, but he did make some good saves. So he's going to be a solid keeper if you do want to go for Marquinhos. So I don't mind him at all. But I think the team we're going to rearrange it a little bit again but thanks for watching boys drop a like on today's video we haven't taken a loss we haven't taken any losses and and that's probably best because if i was taking losses you think it's like just me reacting to those um defeats it's not i just know that we're not playing to that optimum that we need to be at to get elite three comfortably i know and we need to make the changes to be able to do that and we will thank you for watching leave a like and i'll see you on the next one team out peace